So, if you beat up Gus, basically he'll run off like a little pansy. Crud, you dumb video game heroes always pull this stuff, it's ridiculous! You think violence solves everything, don't you? Huh? Don't you? Oh, dicks standing in front of doorways that make you pay for... or to get by are just as annoying too, so... Taught that guy a lesson, I'm stupidly happy. What's up? This size has some of the worst crime anywhere here in Roport. Man, everyone who lives here is real tough and street smart too. I mean, when you don't have any money, you gotta be tough just to get by. Well, that guy's pretty, um, warning like. And you can slip through here since it's a really, really small space. I mean, there's footprints on the ground. Just to show you what's up. You come a little bit back here, you must have seen some da serious dangerous action. Yeah, I just caused some serious dangerous action too. Hey guys, and we're back for more, uh, Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. The reason why I came back here, if you see that thing up there, you probably wonder what the fu- Oh, wow, there's one down here too. Hmm, ain't that sweet. Alright, so I'm not sure how to exactly get up there unless there's a different route, but for now, I am just want to get that star piece back there that I didn't really know about until just now. How funny. <laughs> okay, and here, and just in case, guys, just to show off another aspect, if you ever want some money, here's a trouble center. And basically, yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, actually, I'll just explain it for you. Oh, see, so get out. What the fuck? Okay, I'm gonna kick your ass. Alright. Fine. God. Blah, 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 blah. Basically, he's gonna just tell me that I can choose any, like, things on the, or choose any, uh, troubles on the board and solve them for money. Yeah, yeah. But remember, if you decide not to solve a crime, you have to pay to cancel, which is pretty fucked up. You got that? Well, good. Then he go help someone else. So this trouble center is actually kind-hearted. And I got all these things, and they don't really tell you how much you're going, or... They don't really tell you the price for helping them out, so keep that in mind. I'll try to get like a little descriptive trouble center thing going on. But it's it's kind of helpful. And then we, you can duck the back here and talk to all these strange people. And this is how you get this star piece up there. Oh wait, it's another star piece, isn't it? Okay, let's see. Nope, I think that was just a star piece back there. And who the hell are you, buddy? You look out of place. Hey, I'm, my name is Dorkly. I like dim places. Now I'm done talking for now. I'm now done talking for now. Good redundancy, buddy. Well, uh, that guy's very, um... Yeah. And it's up with you. Hehehe, <laughs> I'm pulling another card trick today and making tons of loot. But someone started tailing me, so I came here to hide for out for a while. Don't tell anyone you saw me here. I'll bop you. Um, I just bopped that guy over there. You want to be like that guy? Hmm. That's just a warning. Okay, so now that I've taught that guy a lesson, or thought I did, we're gonna go down in this pipe since we don't really have much to do up here anymore. <coughs> Alright, so, so far, and one thing to no note about this little thing, now that we have this ability, we can just slip through these bars. But before I go any further down there, let's head to the left, show off, off what's over here. I think not only there's a star piece, like, right behind here. There's this guy. My name is Dazzle, and I collect star pieces. Hey, you're kind of, you're named after my freaking uh, console recorder thingy. And the more I collect, the happier I am. I'm glad to see that you do like your job. So if you have any star pieces, I'll trade my badges for them. Yay! So come on, let's trade. I'll do it. We badge we want. Okay, so he has a really good selection of badges. This is what you want to save up for, no doubt, because you'll be needing it in the um, <coughs> later stages of this game. Well, mainly if you're doing a double paint badge. You don't need it so much, and you can get this badge if you're too lazy to tattle on every enemy. Uh, you can get all these other badges pretty much are going to help you out slightly. This is pretty eh. But yeah, these are good assortment of badges. Power Plus and Power Plus P are going to be pretty good, too. <coughs> so it's something to look into. And I would probably get these, too, because considering that you're pro I'm probably going to focus on upping my heart points, 
Oh, shut up, buddy. I didn't have enough. Um, then uh, that will definitely help out with uh, conserving your FP. So I'm gonna head in this pipe now, now that I'm done explaining everything. And we're probably gonna kill some more Goombas and some more Spinyas. Alright, drop down here, what's up? Oh, we can slip in here too, though. But this is not a recommended area to go to. Look at this shit. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna slip by those yet. I'm not sure what's in this little area over here. I think there might be... Oh, it's good to look around, I guess. Wow, it's just a fucking dungeon. What is this, area used to be a dungeon or something? I'm just curious of that. But what you want to do is you want to head down here, now that we're I'm done wandering around aimlessly. And we'll re see that guy. What the fuck? You saw that too, didn't you? Hey, Mario, you see that? That was one of those things... Professor Frankly mentioned. Yep. Alright, so we're gonna slip in here. Thanks, Coop, for being such an observant eye. Oh, what the hell? I'm gonna kick your ass. Come here. Come here. Yeah, you can't run now. <laughs> Eek! D don't, don't eat me! I don't eat things that look like you. I eat chicken, though. Huh? Uh, you didn't come to eat me? You're not bullies? Guess again, nerd! No, leave me alone, you big bees! Uh, Mario, that was uncool. Don't say stuff like that. I thought you were nicer. Oh, sorry. I was just being joking. I was just joking. Relax, relax, little guy. If we're not boys, I swear. For real? Whew. Boy, that's good. I thought I was sick and I might have an at What? Hey, um, aren't you one of those creatures from Boggly Woods? Why are you down here? What? Uh, how you, why you know about... Why do you know about me? No, you... you must be... You guys are working for the x aren't you? You chased me here. No, it's the end! x What the heck are those? Sounds like tissue to extreme. <laughs> wow. Coops, you certainly have some interesting ideas going on in your head. Look, we're not... We're not here to do anything to you. Just so relax. Tell us what's going on, okay? Okay, this guy, bad guys who call themselves the Exnos, came to live where, came to where I live. They came inside a great tree and started tearing it apart and causing trouble. Sounds like a bunch of assholes. So I come all the way here looking for help. Well, it looks like you found our help. Your help, I should say. It's a bunch of bad guys in the great tree. If those guys are the same guys who kidnapped the princess. They want the crystal star. Now that you mention it, there's something about the, some crystal star thingy. Oh, crap. But we peonies don't know anything about the crystals or stars. Say, so, could you help us out? Maybe we could chase them off? If you do, I'll give you a... Uh, what was it? The crystal star? If you do, uh, we'll have the pe peony adler give you that. I don't know what it is, but it'll help us reclaim our tree. I'm sure the elder will agree. So what do you say? Let's not waste any more time, I'm begging you! Well, yeah, Mario's gonna definitely agree. Yes, I'm not joking. And Mario isn't too. Guess we should, I'd feel pretty proud if we didn't do anything. Plus, we don't need to get the- we do need to get the Crystal Star for the X guys, dude. Oh, wow, are you already, are you already mispronouncing it, dude? Alright, so I've got a new buddy, his name is Pino. I'm guessing he's trying to be like Mario. Okay, let's see. Yeah, you you show us where to go. And he'll do some crazy stuff, I think. Okay, we, you're gonna have to tell me what's up now. Wait, hang on a second. Uh, yeah. I'm sure the puny editor says some button around here opened a secret entrance. Aha! What the hell? Okay. That's interesting, but he here is what you want to do first. Once you enter this door, go left. Because it also opened up this spot. Look at this, I'll be needing this badge when I get enough BP for it. Well, let's see, what can we sacrifice? And before I do anything else, I'm going to show off uh, what uh, Goombella got in her little power-up thing. <coughs> and let's see, I don't think I need... Hmm. Where's that other badge? Let's see, how much does damage dodge? Two? Damn. Um, crap, what has to go here? Well, I guess I can just get more BP and just equip that or something. Because I'm going to definitely be needing that for future areas. What's up, guy? 
You can get in the woods we punies live by going through that pipe there. Okay. Hurry, hurry. Okay, stop rushing me, damn it. Alright, guys. And now we start chapter two. My god. We're already on the second chapter, and it's like 16 videos in. Shit. And it's been like 15 minutes each video. Ooh, I think I'm going to be on this for a good while. The Great Boggly Tree. Sweet. Alright. But I will warn you guys, this chapter is not one of my favorites in this game. In fact, I would say this is the lamest chapter in Paper Mario Thousand Year Door, but by lame, I don't mean that bad. This is definitely not chapter 6 of the original bad. That was boring as fuck. But enough about that, let's talk about Boggly Woods. Oh wow, this place looks... All... One thing that's nice about this place, the layout. It looks nice. Yeah, I don't know what we're gonna run into coops. What's up, little guy? Alright. <coughs> Your little sister? Oh my gosh, is she married? Oh wait, you're like, stupidly small. Never mind about that. Okay, and besides, Mari has Peach. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna... I think Coops needs a break. He's been talking too much. His throat's hurting. Let's get some womanly blood out here. And save our game. But you probably have noticed that Goombella has a lot more HP now that she powered up. She has a, as much as Mario. What the hell? Ah, oh, fuck! Ah, uh, not good. Um... Vivian, you understand what we gotta do, yes? Mm-hmm. A, find that Mario guy. And B, steal the map to the Crystal Stars, right? We can just do away with Mario's friends, can't we? Or is that bad? Oh, bad things happen all the time, Vivian, but you're right about our goals. If my information is correct, Mario should be coming down the road quite soon. Oh, shit. You must end bush him here and get that map! Ah, fuck. Hmm, what's this now? Vivian! What are you this what's that you're fawning over there? Um... What the hell? Oh, you mean this? I found it near that tree over there a while back. Is it a gorgeous necklace? It was so lovely, I just had to pick it up. <laughs> Vivian, for shame, picking up someone's scraps? Disgusting! Greedy! But enough about that. Vivian, my dear Packrat, bring out the sketch of that Mario guy that you got from Grotus. <laughs> oh, God. Uh-oh, someone's fucked up. I don't have that- Oh, shit. Um... Uh, what the hell? Wow, so these people are gonna squabble about it. You wretched little worm, blaming me for something you probably screwed up. Ah, fuck. But, but I... Oh no, someone just spotted me. Fuck. And she seems to be very alertish about it. Oh, what is it, Marlin? Hmm? Oh, crap. Oh, wow, thank goodness. Thank goodness she doesn't know. Whew. Too busy getting pissed off at somebody else because they can't remember some what some guy looks like from. I mean, he has a fucking mustache. How can you forget what Mario looks like? Silence, you dits! Oh goodness. Oh wow. Force? Oh no, you're not gonna. Sl oh, you're gonna take that from her. Damn it! For your punch, me, I'll be taking that necklace you just found. Yes, so sorry. Oh, what a dick. Or bitch, or whatever you want to call Bedlam, or Beldum. Yes, she is horrid. Okay, so while they're having their little sister squabbles, I guess it's your sister. What's up? Oh, uh, you're just gonna have to suck it up. Sorry. <laughs> what is it, Mr. Mustache? Leave us scram right now! I have no business with you. And what about you? Oh God. Oh, well, too bad I don't even understand what she says. What do you have to say about Aunt all these people? Strong, silent type. Can't get a... Wow, you can't read these people? Are they that shadowy? <laughs> hmm. Well, you know what's kind of funny, guys? But I'll keep that for another video. Uh, this is not technically... yeah. Well, well, I'll explain that in another video, but it'll surprise you, maybe. Or not, I'm sure everyone knows by now. But, uh, we'll leave those sisters to themselves right now. 